this geezer well chuffed about his flavours I'm guessing could be chuffed about anything but probably it's his flavours anywho what I like to do when I'm buying flavours is always buy one that I'm not too sure about because then you're trying something and you're expanding the horizons um, everyone knows it's hard to find a fake flavour that you like so the easiest way I find is one subscription boxes that can just give you any flavour that they feel fit or two just buy a random flavour that you're not sure you're going to like if you don't like it share the love pass it on we all love loving anyway two flavours both by Buddha Vapes UK branded UK brand sorry uh, manufactured in the UK uh, there's a lot of them there's a lot of them to go through which means you're going to have to put up with more while I review them all um, first one I do is Bam Tones so that colour purple look at it thick oh let me just say actually they are these are free mode but they do 0, 3 and 6 like everyone else and they're an 80-20 VG so sub on vaping nice chunky clouds especially for Conley McClairson um, I love clouds, we love clouds, we all love clouds. Get back to the point anyway. Um, so, it's called Vamp Toes. The flavours are, or flavour profiles, are grape, raspberries, and blackcurrant. I don't know what that says to you straight away, but the colour said to me, Hall Suvers. That's what I thought. I thought it was going to be a whole suit. I've seen them out there and I know that flavour exists, so I thought that's what that was going to be. And I'm not sure about that. But looking it up on the internet, and it's fairly fucking obvious, Vimptoes is exactly the same as Vimptoes. The, the ingredients of Vimto are grape, raspberry, and blackcurrant. That is how you make Vimto. So um, there's a little bit more to it, but that's the flavour of Vimto. Um, not a cheeky Vimto, no. There's no Vino in that. For you uh, alcoholics, you're getting a little bit totty over there. So uh, we'll get this cracked open and have a little sniff. Right, okay. So, I said it's not Hall Suvers. The internet said this was Vimto. It's Hall Suvers. It's, it's like I am sat on the bus home in the middle of the winter and there's that old guy sniffing away, unwrapping his Hall Suvers. Yo, bruv, give us one of them. My throat's a bit tricky. No, that's what that sounds like. I'm not having any of that. Well, I'm going to have some of that, but, um, yeah, it's a bit weird, but there's, there's been a few flavours that I've smelled before I've vaped, and they taste nothing like they smell. Maybe that's just me, but, so, first of the butter vapes, Vamp Toes. Do -do -do. Very cloudy, very flavourful, definitely not all too for I'm about to say. It is actually really nice. That is um, as close to the taste of Vimto you're going to get without your mouth getting wet. Um, that is good, that is really good. Um, I've said it before, I'm not a fan of fruit flavours. I like them, I'll vape them, but not my vape all day. If you like fruit flavours or if you like soft drink flavours, uh, I think this would be a good one for you. So, actually, if you've not tried it, I think you should try it. Uh, after the little talk. Cloudy enough, tasty enough. Um, not a lot more to be said about that. That's good. Lamb toast, I like it. Um, plenty of flavour, definitely a lot of flavour. So the raspberries and blackcurrant you can't pick out, but the grape is there's an aftertaste of the grape. You can taste grape, and I love grape flavours. Um, winner. Let's move on to the next one. Right before I get grief, and now I shouldn't be using a Kangatex sub tank on one of these, but I am ill-equipped, and I only have one decent tank. So I have filled this with my king of the custards. Straightforward flavour, I'm guessing cream and custard. Um, uh, right, I'm going to stall because I'm not too sure what there is to say about cream and custard. Like, I bought it because I'd like it, and the other flavours I wouldn't like. Or not I wouldn't like, I thought I'd try this more. Like I, like, like I said before, I like all my bakery kind of flavours. Um, but this is the cream 
of the custards, the king. So that's why this guy's laughing his head off, because this is going to be the winner. Winner of all custards, I'm telling you. No Victoria sponge because the custard is that good. Let's have a little go on it. I'll tell you what though, that is, out of all the ones I've, I've tried plenty of custard flavours from your homebrew flavours to your, that, that is the king. I'm telling you, that is the king. Clouds even on this tank bag. My initial thoughts when I bought this was custard flavours, or I, I, I think the custard flavours always seem like they need that little bit extra. This has enough flavour and enough taste, and you can taste the cream. Like a lot of them will say, oh yeah, we're cream and we're custard. No, no, I mean, you know, just custard. Just pack it in sunshine. Now, this, this is cream and custard, like. I've never had a ball of cream and custard, but this is what it bloody tastes like, I'm telling you. So, my verdict on Buddha Vapes, I've had two, I'm not sure how many out of, the, out, out of their range here that they have. Um, thumbs up for both of them, I'd definitely try the other ones. The other ones do actually taste, look quite nice, there's like a, a red cherry crush, um, a Heisenberg flavour, which everyone seems to bum, they love that shit, everyone does, but I'm not a fan of menthol. <laughs> anyway, I digress. Winner winner, chicken dinner, Buddha Vapes, check them out if you haven't already. These cost me £12. I've seen a lot of sites are doing free, free for £20. I went to a vendor in in my local my local vendor and paid two for 20 which I thought was reasonable. We have two 30ml bottles. Um, yeah, check them out, definitely check them out. I think they're, uh, they're some good flavours. That cream of custard though, oof, it's more-ish. Like, as soon as it's gone, you just want a little bit more. Keep it cloudy.